Hey guys, I am doing a little progress video for you guys. Uh, finished sorting all my fiber. <laughs> and, um, yeah, <laughs> it was a lot of fun. So, I've been spinning and I did some crochet today. I haven't done any knitting today. But spinning, I finished this bobbin. And hopefully you guys can see the colors. There you go. This is some um, alpaca and wool blends. Um, and this is from some of the meal ends from that I was separating yesterday. So I finished filling that bottom up so now that bottom is resting. I finished the orange. There you go. And it's a little bit darker than that. It's more of a pumpkin orange. And I also finished spinning the punta. And these colors aren't true either, but once this bobbin rests um, for another day, I'll go ahead and apply that as well. So I have four, five bobbins that need to be plied up. Crochet-wise, um, I'm working on the second pair of shark socks. This time, I modify the way the tail is made. So I changed the way the tail is made. I like my way better. Let's so see. Where's the shark? He's eating my arm. I gotta still do the heel, afterthought heel. But uh, yeah. Oh, the shark. Yeah. Eating my arm. I gotta do his eyes, the mouth, the gums, and the teeth, and the and the the heel. And these guys will be pretty much ready to go and weave in the, the last of the end. So here's the other one. <laughs> oh, both my arms are getting bitten off. <laughs> so the tail is basically three triangles now. That's why how I modify the tail. I make three triangles, and I like having a little gap in between because it makes it gives it some mobility, you know. So that's why I left the. I didn't seam these because I like the way it let it move. It didn't stiffen it up, you know. Like if you put that part together, then it kind of loses some of that that floppy flappiness, tail fin flappiness, and so yeah. They look pretty good laying down flat, too. So, I'm happy with that. I worked on my daughter's blanket some more with the yarn that I had left. I still have just, I can't do any more yet because all I have left is the medium rust. Um, and so the next, I have to wait for the, the order to come in to finish her blanket, uh, which was the, um, what is it called, tweed stripe. Orchid and Tweed Stripes Wildfire. So I have to wait for that yarn to come in so I can finish her blanket. Basically, I will get the next color will be the Tweed Stripes Wildfire. Then this medium rust. Then a Tweed Stripes Orchid. And then I will alternate the Wildfire and Orchids until I run out of yarn. So, and then her blanket will be finished. And um, so, um, that's pretty much all I have going on right now. I, uh, I'm not tired. I don't know why I'm just been yawning, but I'm actually not tired. So, oh well. And after I finished, I'll finish these socks tomorrow. And then I'll work on another project for a little while. And then I'll start the next pair of socks because I just don't see myself doing all 
back to back to back to back socks um sharp socks so yeah and also I don't know if it's still going on but if you're a De La Soul fans go over to their official website you can download their and all their albums for free So you might want to look into that. Okay, and that's pretty much all that's going on with me. And like I said, it's gonna be a quick update. Uh, anything you guys want to hear about or anything, you know, just let me know. I was thinking about doing that 50 questions thing, but y'all know me. I'm gonna know something, just ask me. I don't need to take a questionnaire. I'm taking doing enough questionnaires, filling out job applications right now. <laughs> So y'all take care.